At its next meeting in Abuja, the old Progressive Congress agreed to extend the tenure of its leadership. The NEC has decided to extend the tenure of the current NWC and other executive committees at various levels uh, for another 12 months. Some party members kicked, but the opposition was muted. Many thought the issue was rested once and for all. That was not to be. President Buhari at another meeting took the stage and pronounced the extension of the John Odige Oyegun led executive as illegal. He relied on the APC constitution, amongst other considerations. I have taken time to listen uh, to my legal advisors. Uh, constitutionally given to me in terms of the Ministry of Justice that uh, our decision is contrary to both the party and the constitutional position. The president's stand elicited reactions across the country, amidst all of which governors of the APC met to take a position. First, they met at the presidential villa, then moved to the Secretariat of the Nigerian Governors Forum. At the end, they were not forthcoming with a clear position. To make sure everything is good and everything is getting better and better and better. What about the tenure extension? We are consulting. We are consulting. However, the day after, they met with President Buhari, then spoke to reporters. They deny there is any crisis in the party and resolve to toe the path of the president to hold fresh congresses at all levels. We consulted all the governors, 24 of the APC governors were on the same page with Mr. President that we are going to respect our party constitution, we are going to respect our, 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 our constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. It is yet to be seen if this step will indeed put the issue to rest with less than a year to the general elections. From the presidential villa in Abuja, Ibrahim Adra, Channels Television News.